I go. One, two, three, and four, five. One, two, three, and four. And then I'm going to put my right foot and repeat it to close towards my left. Five. Five. One, two, three, and four. Five. Right? So only five steps. The sacada happens on four. The enganche happens on the five. It happens is that I'm rotating, but I'm also moving her. So by the time I get there, she's already up. Right? So I have to stop her torso. One, two, three, and I stop her torso. I'm going in. Then I move her. Right? Let's give it a try again. Five, and six, and seven. Here we go. And one, two, three, and four. Now hold it back. So you're going to close in front of the lady, right? Once the lady crosses, we're going to create a small back step as the lady goes through. Good. And as she's going forward into an ocho, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a sacada with my leg, and then the gancho that is going to be produced from her leg to mine. So watch this. I'm going through in between, creating momentum. She doesn't change weight, but she creates a gancho. Step on two, step on three, back sacada on four. Now she's creating a suspension. I'm going around. Good. I'm creating a back ocho. One stop, and then I'm closing my feet actually into a sandwich. I'm going backwards, creating one sacada, and through the stop, I'm going to create that momentum to create the gancho. Right, we're gonna put the music on. I want you to try it on your own time. <laughs> 